Hi YouTube friends, it's Diaper Kiddo Jason, and sorry about the handy cam quality of my video tonight. Um, I'm using my good camera, but I'm I don't have it on the tripod, so like there's crazy shadows and it's bad. But uh, I wanted to do a kind of quick video tonight because I have some pretty cool stuff that's going on that I wanted to tell you about. <sighs> Today has been quite a day. Um, let me see if I can center myself better. Sorry. Like, oh my god, the lighting. Um, all of my lights are still in my closet. Um, where they will remain for three more weeks. Um, so, okay, I have a lot to tell you about. Um, first of all, I think I told you guys in a previous video that my husband and I were planning on moving within our apartment complex into a larger apartment with my little, uh, who's going to be moving in with us. Um, sort of like a roommate situation. Um, he's my best friend. He's my little. I'm his daddy. It's, you know, really good. He's really good friends with my husband. Um, so he's going to be moving in with us, which is amazing. Um, and we put ourselves on the list for a larger apartment. Like, I don't know, forever ago. It feels like three months or so. It, I don't think it's been quite that long, but it's been a while. And we were told it wouldn't take long. Um, so... One of the things that I had planned to do, and I've told you this before, is uh, when I get my own bedroom, uh, so that I don't have to sleep on this god-awful couch anymore, uh, when I get my own bedroom, I'm going to be turning it into a little bedroom. Um, like, not quite a nursery, but like a little boy's room, basically. And so I've been kind of back and forth all over the place trying to figure out uh, what sort of furniture I wanted for the room and you know, things like that, like how I wanted to design it. And I've come up with like a really cool idea for like the theme that I want to go with. Um, I'm going to be going with like rocket ships and stuff like that, like aliens and stuff. But I want to go with like a, I guess you would call it like retro futuristic sort of thing. It's going to be um, like the Jetsons kind of thing. Like what like the 1950s thought that the future was going to look like. Um, so like very... Um, retro, like Marvin the Martian kind of rocket ships and things like that. Um, it's going to be pretty cool. I'm really excited about it. And so I found some cool stuff that I'm going to put in my room. And I'm going to show you the first thing. Oh my god, with the lighting. I'm so sorry. Um, oh, bad lighting. Um, but I want to show you the first thing that I got. Like, this is literally the first decor item that I've gotten for the new bedroom. Um, and I found this at Michael's Crafts, but this is kind of a good idea of the, like, aesthetic that I want to go with. And don't laugh at me because this is a birdhouse, but I didn't care I had to get it. I'm going to find a repurpose for it, but, like, that is sort of the design aesthetic that I want to go with. Um, and so I got that the other day, and that's my first decor item for my new bedroom that I'm going to be getting. And then, I guess it was probably about a week and a half ago, maybe a week ago. Um, it was a little over that. Uh, my husband and I went to a furniture store in a town here um, to look at... Oh, no, sorry. This is just not working. Like, I need my tripod. I hate this. But um, my husband and I went to a furniture store here in town to find bedroom furniture for me. And we didn't know when we were going to be moving or like oh my god that light i really hate that light up there i'm sorry um but we didn't know when we were going to be moving or anything like that uh but we wanted to go ahead and look for bedroom furniture and there was a new furniture store opening up here in town um that we haven't had before we've been to literally every furniture store in my county looking for furniture uh, we've been to antique malls we've been to all kinds of places and this new furniture store opened up and we went in on opening day like their grand opening and they had like a huge sale and so i want to show you guys now we're in the living room right now i admit this is weird but this is a temporary solution but i got a bed like a really cool bed um let me see i'm gonna flip this around Okay, so it's got built-in, like, 
dresser drawers kind of thing, which I've already got my dino jammies in there. Um, and it's also got shelves on this side that I'm going to be using for like diapers and things like that. And then it's got a stairway that goes up to the bed. It's a platform bed. Um, I've been sleeping in it. I've been sleeping so great. Oh my god, I can't even tell you guys. Um, but here's what I really think is cool. Like, check this out. These are the stairs. And they all have hidden drawers. So, this is my new bed. And, like, I've already gotten... I'm going to show you one more thing. We had another new store open up here in town called Five Below, which I have shopped at before when I lived in North Carolina. But I got pillowcases that have constellations on them. And unfortunately, they did not... I'm going to flip you back around. But unfortunately, they didn't have the matching sheets to go with it in a twin, which is what my bed is. Um, they only had... XL twin and full. So I couldn't get the matching sheets, but I liked the pillowcases. I think they're going to work with the theme. Um, and then the last part of my big day. Like, this has been kind of insane. Actually, I'm going to go up on my bed for this part. Like, mind you, I'm probably going to fall trying to hold my camera while going up the stairs. Oh. Okay. Okay, that's better. Oh. I'm laying on Walter. But the last part of my big crazy day... Uh, here's Walter. Um, but yeah, so the last part of my big crazy day was... We had planned this morning I was going to go out to my mom's house and pick her up and bring her back here. And then we were going to go to our museum that we have here in town. Um, we live in a small town in the middle of nowhere that has a giant, enormous, beautiful museum with, like, classical art pieces. It's amazing. And, like, nobody ever goes there. And my mom's never been. So, and she's lived here, I think, since she was a teenager, she's lived here. So, like, the fact that she's never been to our museum is kind of insane. So, I was going to go out and pick up my mom and take her to the museum with my husband. We were, the three of us were going to go, and then we were going to go... Um, get dinner and just kind of hang out for the day. And no sooner did I leave the apartment, um, I stopped and got gas, and I dropped off the recycles, and then I stopped and got gas. And I was just a little ways down the road, and my husband called me and said, where are you and your mom? And my mom lives an hour away, and I had only been gone like 10 minutes. So I'm like, my mom, I'm assuming, is at home. I'm in my car driving towards her. I haven't even left town yet. And he says, well, hurry up. You need to hurry and go get her and come back. And I said, why? And he said, because I just got a phone call. They have a three-bedroom open, and they want us to take a look at it. And so we found our apartment. So, like, move-in day is going to be three weeks from today, today being Saturday. So in three weeks on Saturday, we're going to be moving into our brand-new three-bedroom apartment. It's a two-story uh, townhouse. Uh, Domino is going to love having all the extra space because, I mean, you guys have seen my little apartment, like, it's tiny. Like, we, we're we going from a tiny one bedroom to a giant three bedroom, it's gonna be amazing. Our rent is going down instead of up. Uh, like, we're actually gonna be paying like $65 a month less than what we were going to be paying to stay here, uh, just because we're splitting it with my little, uh, which is kind of amazing. Like, we're moving into a much larger space and we're saving money, it's kind of weird. Um, he's gonna be saving a ton of money because he's gonna be paying a third of the rent uh, on a three bedroom as opposed to all of the rent by himself on a one bedroom. Uh, so I think he's going to be saving like $200 a month just on the rent. Um, and it's going to be kind of awesome having him around because I really do get lonely. I never leave my apartment because I'm working from home and then I'm home after work. So like I never go anywhere. Um, but yeah, so like it's going to be really exciting. Um, we're going to be saving a ton of money to do it. Uh, like, I'm just genuinely very excited. Like, I can't wait. Like, I get my own bedroom that I can decorate as a little bedroom. Like, I've always... Like, I'm going to have the bedroom that I wanted when I was a little boy. So, like, that's kind of cool. And I am going to kind of miss this apartment. I mean, we've been here for, gosh, several years now. Um, so I am going to kind of miss this apartment. But I'm not, like... 
I'm not crying over it because like we're staying in the neighborhood. We love this neighborhood. They're really great for dogs. Nomino loves living here. Um, our new apartment is going to be not far from this one, um, but it's actually going to be on our lake. Like we get a lake view um, and it's still really close to the dog park that we have here so I can take Domino to the dog park. Um, I'm not sure how she's going to handle being in a new space because the entire time that we've had her, we've lived in this apartment. Um, this has always been home for her, so like I'm a little worried that she's going to miss home kind of thing. But we're going to take good care of her and make sure that she gets used to her new home. Uh, so I'm, yeah, I'm like really excited. Oh my god, this bed is so comfortable. Like, you guys do not know. I've been sleeping on a recliner on a couch for like three years. Being able to sleep, like, in a bed is amazing. Um, and my sleep apnea really, like, or whatever that is, my stop breathing and my sleep thing really hasn't been very bad at all. Um, I don't think it's, like, actual true sleep apnea. It's something to do with how giant my tonsils are, but we won't even go into that. But, um, because I've got, like, really elevated with these pillows, like, I'm sort of almost sitting up like I was on the couch. Um, so I can sleep in a real bed, but I can still sleep elevated. And so it's making a world of difference. Like, I have more energy, I feel better. Um, it's kind of amazing, actually. So those are my big updates. Um, I'm probably not going to be doing a video for a little while because we have three weeks to pack up everything we own and move it into the new apartment. Um, so, and my husband is in the middle of a crazy period with his work, so like I don't know how that's going to go. I think I'm going to end up having to do most of the work myself, which kind of sucks, but um, he's going to help as much as he can. But... I have three weeks to pack everything. It's going to be insane. But once we get into the new space, then my next video that I plan on doing is going to be the big moving video and then the big reveal of my little room um, will be after that. Like, I want to do a video for the move and then I want to do another video to show you guys once my room is finished. I'm very excited. I have found some really, really cool uh, stuff thematically uh, that's really going to fit into the bedroom that I'm imagining in my head. So, um, I think that's like all of my updates. Um, oh, oh, I ordered a case of the North Shore Mega Man, or it's not Mega Man, hold on. Um, Mega Max, that's what they're called. Um, I ordered a case of those. For whatever reason, my brain reads Mega Man every time I see them. Like, I need to get some stickers for my diapers that have Mega Man. Um, but I ordered a case of those. I'm really impressed with them. They're um, really secure feeling like I feel like I'm locked into like a cotton fortress like there is like yeah it's secure um and they're extremely extremely absorbent I'm really happy with them but I'll show you like they remind me of the comfort right 24 sevens but like of like a higher quality like it feels more quality um but so I ordered a case of those. I think I'm gonna order another case because um, they're. I think it was forty. A case of forty diapers for eighty dollars, which is about what I would expect to spend from like anywhere premium, um, but like not as big of a case or as big of a cost. Like I was expecting to spend like one fifty or one sixty to get like a case of like eighty of something. So I feel like I ordered a half case at half price, which is kind of weird. I don't know why they don't come in a bigger case than that. But I think I'm going to order another case of those soon. Um, hopefully before we move so that it has time to get here. Um, but yeah, that's my updates. I'm really happy. I'm very excited. It's going to be a little while before I do another video. Um, you can expect another video in three weeks from today. So whatever I uploaded this video is probably going to be close to three weeks. Um, before I can do my next video, but uh, I want to do a video about the move um, so you can guys can you guys can kind of see the before and after of us moving everything in. Um, and maybe I don't I don't think he'll actually do it. I was gonna say maybe my little will be in the video with me, but I, he's shy, so um, he does exist. He's just very shy, like my husband, who you know if you guys will recall from the last video. Um, it's a miracle he let me place him in the video, even with his sunglasses on. But, yeah, that's my updates. So, I'm not going to drag this video out longer. It's been 15 minutes, um, so I don't want to drag it out too much longer. But I wanted to let you guys know where I'm going to be for the next three weeks that you're not hearing from me. And then, hopefully, I'll have another update afterwards. 
So in the meantime, I'm tired. It is 12.30 a.m., um, which is still pretty early for me. Um, but I'm probably going to watch some cartoons and then crawl in bed. Well, I'm in bed, but I'm probably going to watch some cartoons from bed and then go to sleep. Um, that's kind of great that I can, you know, watch my giant TV from the living room from my bed because my bed is in the living room. It's weird. <sighs> so anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. Sorry for rambling. I'm tired. It's been a long, crazy day. But I wanted to let you know what my cool updates are. And I love my bed so much oh my god like just wait just wait see you next time guys <laughs> bye